Oh, such a lovely day. And I've got something to say. We should have been said on the month May, but on this very stage, not any enclosed bay, I, Mamacita, stand to distinguish myself from fake. This speech you're hearing is not talking about corruption, yet all get a fair cut of the cake. Pop out the champagne drink, let it fake, and lend me your ears as I begin to pray. Oh, good Lord. So many Africans have gone astray. The system killing us and grown most aspray, waiting to be victimized, brutalized, and be slain. But I give you the future's account and its date, not some meaningless waiting to laugh late, or even some foolish ramen skin pack of crate. I have come to you not to launch any debate, but as long as we are Africans, we have become mates, and not people who sit at any temple's gate, but people who share the same sufferings but still jubilate. Not because we have made it in life, but known ourselves not on tape, but vis-a-vis -vis in the urban city and not in the village. This is not a poem, but a speech dispatched to you, comrade. Rise up from talking point to action point to evade. And the only way out is when we amalgamate. And this amalgamate, we fight not to kill, we fight not to chill, but we fight for equal right and justice and wipe away the wonky criminal intent status. We have rediscovered ourselves not as inferior. After all, we gave them sufficient gold, and they have become rich and bold. They have the gut now to stand with hands akimbo, despising us as though we have not grown out from Nino. And this is what revisit us to ancestral pains. That promise they made to us to help build our lovely continent is far from today's reality. <laughs> To put an end to this becoming lengthy speech, I beseech you Africans, occupants of higher positions, remember God's commandment. Thou shalt not steal, thou shalt not kill, and the rest known to us all. Let us put them to practice, and above all, carry love for ourselves, which is the ultimate. This speech is not to school you. This speech is not to rearrange you. This speech is not telling you about your rights but reminds you of a great speech made by a great African leader. Forward ever, backward, Yankobida, Yankobida, Yankobida.